Hello everyone. Today we'll be talking about how you can download pre-filled GSN from the new income tax website and how you can use it while filing your income tax return. The income tax website lets you download pre-filled GSN and utility. These help you import and pre-fill data from the e-filing portal. And due to this, the entire process of filing income tax return becomes pretty simple. Prior to JSON, there was something called XML or Extensible Markup Language. However, JSON is becoming more popular over XML because it is less verbose, it is faster and it is more predictable. So let us go ahead and see how we can download pre-filled JSON from the new income tax website. First up, log in to IncomeTaxGov.in. You can log in through a number of means like PAN, your Aadhaar or your net banking. And if you need any information as to the different methods of logging into the website, you can check the link given in the description box below. So I'll be logging in through my PAN. Next up, click on continue. Then validate the security message and click on continue. Next up, go to e-file. Under e-file, go to income tax return and go to download prefill data. Select the assessment here and then click on continue. Once there, click on offline and then select the ITR type. Now the ITR type that you select will be based on your requirement. ITR1 is for individuals and Hindu undivided families who have income from salary, pension, from one house property or any other sources of income. It is the most basic ITR. ITR2 is for individuals and Hindu undivided families who do not have any business or professional incomes. It is usually filed by taxpayers who, whose main source of income is through capital gains or by taxpayers whose residential status is NRI. ITR3 is for individuals and Hindu undivided families who have income from business and profession and also in cases where tax audit is applicable. ITR4 is for individuals and Hindu undivided families who have opted for the presumptive taxation scheme. ITR5 is meant for AOPs, LLPs, firms and so on. So go ahead and click the relevant ITR form. Select the filing type as to whether it is modified, original or revised. Then continue. Then go ahead and click on download prefill data. Once you have downloaded the pre-filled data, you have to open the downloaded utility. Now, if you want to know how you can download and install utility, check the link given in the description box below. Okay, so after installing utility, open the utility and click on continue. Then click on file returns. Once there, click on import pre-filled data. Click on continue. Next up, put in your PAN number. And then the assessment here. Click on proceed. Then attach the pre-filled data that you have downloaded. Next up, click on proceed. There, click on file return. Select the option applicable. Then select the relevant ITR form. Once done, click on proceed. And then click on let's get started. Select the reason which is applicable. Click on continue. Next up, you will see this pop-up message which is to notify that the pre-fill data has been imported. So go ahead and click on OK. Once done, you can see that all your basic information like your name and Aadhaar has been imported. You can follow these steps to file your ITR on the income tax portal or you can use Quico to file your returns with assistance of a tax expert or by filing it on your own by selecting the right ITR form, importing trades and much more. If you found this video useful, subscribe to our channel and give us a thumbs up. We are Quico on a mission to simplify taxes for all.